all about nouns. And we learned that nouns are a word that names a person, place, thing, or animal. Now, I will be putting up these little cards every time we learn a new grammar skill. And this one says noun, a person, place, thing, or animal. So like a boy, a shoe, a dog, a pencil, a girl. And I'm going to be putting these. I know they're going to be hard, kind of hard to see, but I normally put them up here underneath my whiteboard and kind of clever touch. And I'll be putting all the grammar ones down there. You kind of notice up there is where the math ones are with I, Todd, and even Steven. So I'll try to put math up there and grammar is going to go down here, okay? My reading ones are going to go in the cupboard on the bottom. And you can kind of see last week I put up the three posters from last week, okay? Okay, now we're going to get to a grammar work worksheet that works with nouns. And it has a lizard on it. And your name should also be on it. It says a noun is a word that names a person, place, or a thing. So their example is my mother collects shells at the beach. In this sentence, we have three nouns. We have mother, which is a person, shells, which is a thing, and beach, which is a place. So down below, this should be pretty easy today, we are going to circle the nouns in the sentence. And I'm gonna draw sticks today. And I'm gonna have my friends come up here and they can use their finger or they can use my pen. And they are gonna circle the nouns. So I see this word is plural, which means there might be more than one in a sentence. Okay, I'm just gonna draw sticks. Good job. Fox is an animal. And Mountain. mountains. Good job. Mountains is a place. Oh, boy. Good job. Good job. Okay, number four. How about I drew I drew Corla again. I'll just set her out. She's getting lucky today. 
How about Liddy? You just passed my name. Very cool. Carla is out in the hall at reading court. Okay, number four, Liddy. Can you read it for your friends, please? And then you can read the card, Liddy. I just noticed something. See, it looks like he's really scared of just simply leaves. Yeah, so Liddy is noticing. There's yeah, a. All, these are word. kind of introducing the noun. We're circling the second word. The second word. We're always circling the second word. And the end. And the very last word. So, read it for your friends, Libby, so they know what the sentence says. Is there any other oh. grandfather hikes up the trail? Good. His grandfather hikes up the trail. Grandfather is a person. Trail is a place. All right. The next one is Carson. Carson, can you read the last one? Oh, mess up the Good job. All right, can you start with this word? Hour. Hour. Meter. Red. Red. About. Penguins. So what would you circle for your nouns? Definitely penguins, those are an animal. That's easy. And there's one more. <laughs> Teacher. Okay, all right, now down below, you are going to write a sentence about a person, place, or a thing, and then you're going to circle the nouns. So, you get to pick. What do you want to write about? A person, a place, or a thing, or an animal. Guys, it could be an animal, too. I know they don't have animals, but you could write about an animal, because this week we're talking all about animals. So, what is an example of what you could write? Uh, what do you think, Abby? Um, my dog is a rat. My dog cool. is a rat. A rat. Now, Addie, what would be the nouns that Mrs. Murphy would have to circle? Dog and rat. Yep, dog. And then lab. Lab is the kind of dog it is. Like a dog. Okay. So I'm gonna write this sentence. You can copy it. You can make it your own. But Mrs. Murphy's looking. Is it capitalized? Does it have a period? And did you circle your noun? Okay. I'm gonna take a couple more examples, and then I'm gonna have you write. Kinsley, what's an example? Um, uh, my. I was gonna say the same thing. My dog is a German Shepherd. Perfect. So you would circle dog and German Shepherd, right? John, can I circle the Brooklyn? Brooklyn, take the pen. My teacher spells my teacher's in during a Halloween party. My teacher is have maybe having a Halloween party. So you circle teacher and Halloween because that's the thing and party. John, take the pen. You already saw that. Okay, two last ones. Lewis. Yeah, why are you trying to do it? I have a fox. So you circle I and fox. And last one, Libby. I have a pencil, but how do you spell pencil? Okay, let's. 